everybody, welcome to the Black Sheep Props channel. I'm Steve, and I'm here to teach you the tips, tools, techniques, and materials for building your very own super cool EVA foam props. We're going to build everything from helmets, to shields, to weapons, to masks, to gauntlets. And we don't have just build videos either. We have a lot of very informative tips videos as well. We're going to look at tons of tips, tools, and techniques that cover every part of what you're going to need to do for building props. Um, we're going to look at EVA foam, what sizes to get, different textures, um, the different thicknesses, different size sheets, um, where you can buy it at. Uh, we're going to look at the heat gun heat sealing our foam to tighten it up and give it a nice shiny glossy cover. We're going to look at heat shaping our foam as well with the heat gun where we can bend our foam and it'll stay in that shape after it cools off. We're going to look at dremeling our foam, grinding off the edges to get nice round edges. Uh, we're going to look at throwing in the sanding sticks as well that goes along with the dremeling. Um, we're also going to look at contact cement in every episode. How to use it, uh, what it does, what you don't want to do with it, uh, little tips on how to put it down smoothly. Um, we're also going to look at detailing our props using a wood burner and using bra sharpened brass tubes to poke out circular rivets um, and using the Dremel to make rivet marks. And uh, also using the X-Acto knife to do cuts and then heating it up with the heat gun to open up the cuts. Lots of cool detail tips we're going to learn through the course of all of our builds and our tips videos. Um, what else? Oh, and we're also going to look at sealing our props when we're done making them with black plastic. It's like a spray-on rubber coating, uh, which is before we paint. We're going to look at different ways to paint with spray and with hand painting with brushes all using acrylics. Uh, we're also going to look at embedding wood dowels, brass dowels, steel rods inside of our prop for stability so they're not wobbly props. Um, tons and tons of cool details in all these videos. We're going to learn tons together. So I'm going to teach you what other people taught me and then you can turn around when you're ready and teach other people everything that you learned from me and then those people are going to turn around eventually and teach other people everything they learned from you. That's how it's going to go. Everybody's going to keep learning and growing and getting better and better at building and hey that's what's so cool about the cosplay and the prop making community is it's a bunch of cool people helping each other build better stuff and cooler stuff. Um, we're going to have a great time. We even have templates for every one of our builds. If you just want to sit and follow along watching, that's totally cool. But if you want to jump in and be able to build your own prop, we've got templates. All you got to do is pick one up and you can follow along with us and you can knock out your own jamming prop. <laughs> so that's the deal. If you can dig that, come on in, subscribe to this channel, and together we're going to go step by step through a lot of super cool builds so that you get the props you deserve. Thank you for coming, and I hope you join the Black Sheep Props family, because we're going to crush it.